YouTube. I am Penstar, and this is Hearthland Strategy and Tactics, episode 15, hopefully not the last episode, because we got a dragon bearing down on us. Today, we will be fighting that. Yep. Now, hopefully this is just a dragon, and not like 11 billion dragons. We also had a little bit of a growth and a shrinkage uh, problem here. Um, and yes, that's as embarrassing as it sounds. Um, and thus we are on worker shortage. Eh, we'll comply if we are live. My, minus 12. Yes, we'll accept that uh, medicine. I'm not going to be keen on actually sending that to you right now. All right. Uh, actually, what we should be doing is getting our troops into position. All of our archer squads need to be behind the wall. Everyone should be healed up from the uh, encounter Orders. with the uh, Warlock by now. Orders. Yes, my lord. Okay, uh, Spearmen can go yes, here. Axemen can go here. We're going to send our two units of horsemen around to the edge of the wall here so that they can come around and flank if Your necessary. Did I grab these archers? I'm going to order them anyway. Yes, my lord. All right. Move it, everybody. Yeah, hold on. I might need that myself. Thank you very much. Here he comes! Alright. Can I can I get a can I get an info panel on him? No? I okay. Uh, Chris Lee's the dragon. Thousand hit points. Jeebus. Uh, does 24 damage. Armored. Can attack from a distance. Deals 50% more damage. Considered heavy armored. A monster. Splash damage. Magical immunity. Can't be targeted by spells. Okay. Well, um, that doesn't mean that our phantom, our magic is useless. We can phantom warriors. Um... Please don't uh, fly over the water or our walls, because he's probably going to roast these two buildings, but that's okay. I just want to see what his attack pattern looks like. We are not going to engage him. In fact, I'm not going to entertain him. We'll have him have at that one. If he's going to focus his attacks on buildings, get you guys over here, but not too close. He made it just in time. They snuck out the stone. That's wonderful. All right, here he comes. Ah, crud. 
Alright, maybe not the best way of engagement. Our towers are uh, doing something. You know what? Maybe uh, your service. At your service. Your Majesty. why don't we guys just retreat? Run away! Wait, are all of our archers... Are, are all of our archers... Uh, Yeah, they're all like going into the guard tower and just arrowing him to death. Look at this. Look at this. Yeah, we still got some good hit points thanks to that tech we researched. Yeah, we didn't need to get our melee troops all killed. I didn't even know you could garrison archers in these. He is totally... I'll come back and burn your city to the ground. That is so cool. And the turd monsters come to, to play. And holy crap, that's a lot of money we got from him. Oh my god, we need so many more archers. That worked out so beautifully well. We made it! We did it, Reddit! Er, we did it, YouTube! We lost a bunch of guys, but now we know our lesson. We don't need our melee guys. We just need to send the archers. Alright, uh, right, we're back in business here. Worker shortage is being taken care of. That is good. This thing will slowly repair itself. Lost a bunch of dudes that I probably didn't need to lose, but that's okay. And with the hay. We'll get back to work. And yes, you know what? We'll give you your freaking stone. Man, had I known. Like, even with his crusher ability, with his ability to do more damage to buildings, he still wasn't going to do that. And now I know to focus my tech on, um, on, uh, freaking, uh, engineering rank two here. Because that's what's going to help hold off the dragon. All right, then. Dragon repelled. And once we get our military back, I think I might go stomp on the goblins a bit here. We still need time to lick our wounds, to be certain. We lost a lot of spearmen. Ha ha ha! We awoken a, uh, a stone elemental, eh? Where's, where's the stone elemental? Is it there or is it up over here? Where's the stone element? Oh, wait. Where's the elemental? Oh, it's the iron element. Oh, it's the last of the iron. Well then. That, uh, that didn't take long, but we'll send the horsies. Wanted to make sure that was an attack order. Don't know if we'll get there on time, but we can send them. Actually, we'll not send them. We will send the Axemen. 
they look like they could probably do a bit of damage to him. This guy is really slow, so... And once they... once these... Yeah, we ran out of the iron there. We're coming, we're coming. We're gonna get a butt-ton of iron from this guy, thank good, thankfully. Oh no, our leather! Holy crap, that's a lot of boots. That is a lot of boots. Because that's a lot of boots. Holy crap. Uh, what are we low on here? Pillows. Oh, of course pillows. We are still desperately, desperate in need of pillows. Yeah, this guy will be crumbling soon. Heck yeah, 11 loads of iron ore. That will help our uh, military and iron production just fine. Oh, hey, and everyone got a whole butt ton of experience from that drop. That works. Alright, everyone back home. Uh, lick your wounds. Ooh, this is coming along nicely. 75% completed. Trade limit increased. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I forgot, um, yeah, we're going to be having a lot of excessive wine here. Whoa, 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 whoa. You best not be killing merchants, little turd monsters. We do not kill we do not kill merchants here. Thank you very much. Let's make sure I'm not selling pillows. I think I still am selling pillows. Yep. But I didn't have any, I didn't sell any of them despite that still being checked off. Let's uh, let's stop with the selling of the clothes cuz those are starting to run low. I'm okay selling the stone. Uh, cause I'm making that enough. Let's stop selling the furniture. Cause we are growing into, uh, I'm okay still se selling that. How are we on food? We are low on food. Let's stop selling the worst. We are, we are, we are growing into that. We'll keep, well, I'm fine still selling the eggs. But yeah, as our population gets bigger and bigger, we need more stuff. I think what we need to do is we need to do another thing of cotton. Another another bunch of cotton farmers. But here, we are going to make the cotton fields the same as the uh, Bountiful Harvest spell. All right, so let's... Let's use a, let's find a good, um, okay, so the top road goes uh, at that little, at that little leaf up there. This little leaf up here. Oops. So if we start our thing from here to here. Now then, um, how wide does it go? Let's find another. I 
All right, this little, this little, uh, this little bushy thing will be our width marker here. This little bushy thing right here. And then last but not least, well here. And because I want to draw it exactly in that shape too. All right, I think it's parallel to the to the tree there. Like if we do it like that, is that correct? Yes. Beautiful. Okay, and now to flesh this out, we know we go one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. We also know we go one, two, three, like that. One, two, three, like that. I mean, I could fill in the whole box, but then there'll be little edges where it's not uh, ideal thing. But you know what? We could just use the extra cotton. Or what we could do, actually, this might be better. Here's what we're going to do. The, because we know the corners aren't, aren't good. Is make the four corners. Um, now how much, how much space are we wasting with that? Exactly one tile's worth. And even then we're, uh, we have a couple extra. So, you know, that's fine. That's close enough. I like this four corners build here. Um, now I don't think these four will have enough to sow that much land. So we're going to need more growers lodges. So we're going to put one over here, over here. Is that going to be overkill? Might not be. And then obviously we're going to need some uh, cotton getters. And that should help hopefully keep our... Um, you know, the other thing we probably need is another... How's our workers? We still have some unemployment. Let's get another aviary so we can get some more feathers going. Good enough. One rooster. And we'll let you guys accept feathers. That should do nicely. And yes, good. We don't have to wait for the growing season. Everyone will just start planting right away. We'll see if they get this whole thing seeded well enough. But yeah, we definitely needed that extra thing of cotton. And our unemployment continues to grow. All right. I think with our influx of... Uh, booze here, especially since we're, we can stop, uh, stop with the cider, stop with the beer. Because our, our uh, alcohol is going to be good enough. Um, we are full on archers. Let us get another archer squad going. Because we like us, our, we like us some archer squads. In fact, let's get some archer squads closer to here. It just makes a little sense.
Yeah, we're not demolishing that. That freaking structure saved my butt. Beautiful. <laughs> These guys will just keep it home, and then when a dragon comes, we'll, they'll just pop themselves right out. Yeah, we'll dispatch them. Yeah, I know it took us a while, but you got what you needed. Yeah, because we got plenty of alcohol. Got plenty of boots. We can probably stop importing boots. If we are importing boots, we are importing boots. We do not need to import boots. Uh, we're still, still scratching the bottom with our pillows. My goal is to have each of these nice and full. Yeah, we're also scratching the bottom with food. Um, you know what? I think it is time that we started growing some more of our own wheat here so we can get our bread back and running here. Um, I was able to get away with not doing that and importing everything, but uh, I think it comes to a point where um, you gotta bite the bullet. Uh, I'll, I'll make a road for you. And just go back to growing. In fact, I might put back a third field here and get three of these guys. Just so we can make sure that we're feeding everybody. We will make sure that you guys are on grain only. Get you drawn around here. And loop you around like that. Get you tied into the rest of my trade networks here. We really should get you up here. Just so we, our trade networks here are bridged. And you should be bridged like that. That way our walkers don't have to walk too far for all this stuff. And our university is almost done. Oh, with our iron ore uh, exhausted, we need more. We need a couple more of those, but this time we can do it closer to home. Once that iron ore gets taken out, um, then we can uh, we can do something about that. Uh, what do we need to build the iron mine? Oh wait, uh, iron mine. Stone, 24. And we got it. Yeah, it's gonna be another thing, another demand on our stone here. Research available. No, we're good on engineering for now. Yeah, we'll leave it alone for now. Yes, yeah, so, so my minions. Get in there. Now, the question is, will the center be ready to grow and have enough people sowing there? That is an aviary. All right, okay, good. Yeah, because we're... I'm noticing a distinct lack of uh, grain here. Ready to sow. So we are, in fact... So we don't have some massive down... down ticks here. Let's get some emergency food in here. Yeah, how's everyone besides obviously our dragon friend? 
30, and we're at what? 33. I have a feeling if... Uh, I don't want to send it when we're too close to that. That and we also need to get up our raid tech. Um, also the chance of a successful attack. Yeah, let's get to two rounds of raiding and then we can raid the goblin. Because if we burn that to the ground, then we don't have to worry about them. Uh, oh, and yeah, you might uh, pop out and uh, start shooting. Uh, or not. All right, let's see what else we got. That's coming along nicely. You still got plenty of plenty of that right there. You know, we'll just shut this building down. Someone will do something with it. How are the hogs around here? Yeah, there's still pigs around here. So our, our, these guys are keeping themselves busy. These guys might need a recharge. What I might do is, yeah, let's, let's research that last level of Phantom Warriors. Um, bless. I don't know if that works when they're inside there. Divine Inspiration. That might be my next, uh, that might be my next one here. All right, alcohol's doing fine. We're, we're making enough to sell and then some. Cash is doing just peachy. Despite all the expenses, especially on, uh, on construction, especially on our military, we're still doing just fine. Our taxes are helping immensely, though. Yeah, our coins minted are nothing. Like, that's that's a drop in the bucket. I mean, I'm not going to get rid of the industry, but it's still a drop in the bucket. Uh, still some unemployment, but that's, that's fine. Once your unemployment level grows high enough, um, your tax level will go up. Um, and that will decrease the effective available. Oh, okay. You guys are building even higher. So keep, keep at it. I do want that extra lore for that re university. The next one, I think, yep, there's the food. I saw that one coming. Ugh. There's the food. Let's, um, yeah, more turnips and stop selling the eggs. Do we have any other food coming in? I might need to hit up the world map here and ask some people for some assistance. Request goods. You have no worst. Brincaster. You have no flour. Cheese, none of that. You've got a million logs, though. Got a million wine. Should have kept track of who was who had what. Oh yeah, I already asked. I was already looking into you. I guess since I'm buying from them all, that they don't have any to spare. Yeah, I'm buying from them, therefore I can't request even more. I can request um, grain. You know what? We're going to request the grain. And we'll improve relations with some of our majesty. I'm here, my lord. Just to keep our, our bread industry. Oh, we can't.
Ah, uh, I should have done that before. Uh, anyone else have some grain? And I don't need the meat. You've got grain, okay. Let's see if you guys accept. Because we could use the frickin' grain. Just to keep our, our mills busy. You can see our mills aren't busy. That should get them going while we wait for our harvest here to uh, do its thing. Yeah, so here's all this food streaming, and you better get them to these houses. Toot sweet. I will not accept more more population losses. Yeah, growing is tough. It is indeed tough. And these guys, the, lack of food means guys will go all the way down. They will go all the way down unless they're fed. And unfortunately, the stuff that is available for sale, yeah, we'll buy eggs. We're just barely scraping by with pillows. What are we? Yeah, the food. Once again, nah. not, not much, not much to show with the food. All right, what the hell is happening here? What? What to say? Come on, people. I'm here, my lord. I might just build military structures next to the to the uh, sewer things just so they can pop out, murder these damn things. Yep, there's the worker shortage. Oh god, we lost someone completely. We lost a house completely due to lack of food. That is upsetting. Yeah, please don't kill our, our migrants. We need them. And please start bringing food. Alright, good. Whole butt ton of eggs. All right, our furniture's back in good shape. Yeah, that's that kind of snuck up on us. Oh, thank you. We'll accept the seven. Wait, I thought you said we didn't have room. We had plenty of room for the beer. Why did we only six seven instead of the eight? Eh, whatever. All right, this thing is almost done, this university. So soon we will be reaping its benefits. And then we can take a, we can take a look at uh, our next... Uh, hmm, sounds like our, uh, sounds like our military is uh, building itself up pretty quickly. How are we on this uh, archers? Oh, not bad. Not bad at all. Still on the fence about expanding out another thing here. I mean, it, we still kind of need to do this. Um, I do need to get more iron going. So I think our buildup of stone for the moment will be spent on iron mines. There we are. Iron mine. Boom. Can we do another one? Oh, yes, we can. We might need a coal one, though. Just to balance out. Probably need a uh, storehouse here for um, coal, iron, ore, and iron. Might also help if we built another iron smelter, because I know we only have one. So, smeltery right here. 
All right, good. We've got uh, we've got these going here. Aha! And you are all going to flower. I was a little late on the Bountiful Harvest, but I'm going to cast it anyway because that's going to hit most of those. And look at all the look at all that cotton there. We have plenty of room for cotton now. And all those will be double doubles. And that should keep our clothing industry going quickly enough. Yeah, see, why did that why did that that aura wear off on these so fast? Should have affected the whole area equally. Hmm. No, well, no matter. All right, we've got those guys still going. You're still sur harvesting surface iron here. Effective this near. Product storage full. Huh. Not enough coal. Okay, well, it looks like we need more coal. Let's uh, let's import some coal. Uh, no coal. No coal to be imported. Sadness. I have so much money. I need to do something with it. And I got more money than I got people. Um, all right, fine, more coal. We have been a little bit, uh, not enough stone. Well, coal mines will be the, the order of business going forward. And I will keep my eyes peeled for uh, um, a, a, a coal trader. Because I would certainly love to buy some coal at this point. Don't you dare eat those eat those uh, immigrants. Don't you do it. And also this thing is eating up resources left and right. But that's okay. That's what it's meant to do. And this is clearly enough guys to do what needs to be done here. So we're good. We're trading with so many more people now. Um, let's... Yeah, we'll dispatch the clothes. Of course. Like a good neighbor. Uh, one thing we do want to do is let's get that customs up to the top highest level. That's going to help our trade game even more. Because that'll allow us to buy up even more stuff. Because I have a feeling our um, uh, our three things of great. Oh, these things aren't even um, these things aren't even maxed yet. Well, no matter. That worst is piling up there. Boy, look at all this worst going here. Yeah, we definitely disrupted our bread cycle here. All right, um, well, with all that thing, we can start peeling off some of our purchases here. But I'm certainly not going to be, uh, all right, eight of eight. We will constantly be growing archers here. Oh, not enough leadership. Not enough leadership. Whew. All right, well, we'll do that, and then we'll do the uh, trade there. Boy, who knew? Who knew we'd be pushing the boundaries of leadership uh, like that? But yeah, two horses, one spears, one axes, just for the achievements more, more than anything else. 
Um, and everything else like that. You know what? I think we need more weavers. Just to process these. Pillow maker, what do you need? You need more textiles. Yeah. We need more weavers. Make it happen. Start processing that cotton, weavers. And before we cut our episode here, let us not forget about our call. Another call? No call. I'm happy to report you, Majesty. Woohoo! Da 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 da! University! Requires 16 loads of stone, ba 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 ba. Increases appeal. Lore output by 20% and 10 fame a month. Nice. Nice. Ah, uh, so what should our next mega project be now that we've finished off the uh, university? Eh, Wizards Guild. I'm not even going to say, oh, which one are we going to choose? Which one are we going to choose? I know which one we're going to choose. It's the freaking Wizards Guild. And then maybe by the arena. I like that because we don't need the freaking fame output. Where are we going to put it? All right, I'll tease you with that. Where are we going to put the Wizards Guild? Find out uh, in our next episode. So if you like this episode and you want to see more like it, go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and leave me a comment, good, bad, or indifferent. Your feedback is always welcome. So until next time, this has been Pinstar signing out. See ya.